Hey, what's up, guys? <clears throat> is what I'm going to show is the tangent line between uh, the Chicago Sears Tower and the Washington Monument. And we'll see what the drop is uh, uh, between them. So I chose this point. Um, I probably should have chose this one. But I chose this one. Now that I look at it, I should have chose that. But uh, it's probably only what? Not even. About a half mile difference. That's that's nothing. So uh so basically is what I did is I came over here to this data sheet and then I come over here to this XYZ apparatus fill it out Demonstrate real quick. Latitude, longitude, and then uh, meter or the it already gives me the elevation ortho height which is the ground elevation so take that uh, calculator paste it minus then I want to take it minus the geoid height which is that number, so minus that, copy that. I want kilo or uh, feet to kilometers because my drawing's in meter to kilometers. Uh, so feet. Kilometers, paste it, hold on, hold on, meters, not kilometers. I hit convert and then I got my numbers and then I got so here's my text file and they should match somewhat close six five zero four four six four pretty good Four one two three six seven nine, pretty good. So I did a top and bottom, or a ground and then the top, so I can create a straight line. Okay. So. Basically that's what this is. Well, I'll show you real quick. So 
so Jesse gave me these points a while back. So the top of the Empire State Building and the bottom, which is 1,481 feet from that box to that box. So that's the top and that's the ground. And then the Washington Monument is right here. Which is 555 feet tall, top and bottom. Okay. Oh. So when I place them them points in here, they came in right here, which is basically the center. Well, that's my tangent line uh, between here and. Here. Which is this line. Tangent line. That's my line <coughs> between the two. Or that's my arc line. My regular line between the two is this line. So the elevation is a little higher. Anyways, and then I projected that line down to the center. And then created one down that way and then that's how I got my tangent line I don't think it's this one We'll do it like that. Bam. We'll go NC three point UCS to node. My tangent line. So then if I take the bottom up here, which I've already done, draw a line straight up to that tangent and measure it. And that's what I get. with a distance of 20 uh, meters to feet or miles, meters to miles. Okay, so I got 10.91, okay, for the drop. That's hidden, okay. 
so the length of to the halfway, which is zero, that's zero right there. And we're coming straight over. Then I'm drawing the line straight up. And so that line is Two hundred and seventy four miles. Copy that. Go into the Earth calculator, which I already did. So my eye height is zero, two seventy four, and I get a tar uh, that number right there hidden. So we'll put that in miles. Miles to, or feet to miles. So I get 9.47 and I got 10.91. So if I get my calculator, so ten point nine one minus nine point four equals. So I'm, I was a foot off, foot and a half off. Wow. Okay. Now we'll do the other side. Um. the Washington Monument, which is this line. So I drew a line to the top from the from the ground straight up. I got a distance of meters miles 11.74 and so the distance halfway there is Meters to miles, right? Nope. 283 miles. Earth calculator or the, yeah. So zero again, so I want 283. Calculate. Copying. I'm looking for 11, around 11. We'll see what happens. So I want feet to miles. And I get 10. So I'm a, I'm a foot off there. That's pretty good. And that's hidden. Yeah. And of course.
course, the angle between the two is 8 degrees. 8.6. So that was pretty cool. That's my little spot here or not, yeah. So basically this right here is uh this right here empire state building uh liberty one washington the sears tower i just picked a spot down here in houston and over here in la and if i flip it See, hold on. Uh, see how it's curved. Come over here to my model. And it's curved as well, so. Anyway, that, that's uh, pretty cool. Thanks a lot.